All right, baseball fans, what do you say? What do you hear? It's Andy Drifter with a mega box of 2024 Topps Baseball or Topps Heritage Baseball. These are pretty fresh to the scene. It's going to have uh, three exclusive chrome blue sparkle refractors. Missing signature variations, possibly. Maybe an auto. A lot of cards. Let's get into it. Here we go. Uh, 1959 MVPs. Ernie Banks, Mr. Cub, and Nellie Fox. Ernie Banks, over 500 home runs, MVP winner, and has the distinction of playing in the most career games without ever reaching the playoffs. Carlos Radon, Brandon Nimmo, Gavin Williams. Here we got uh, 2006 MVPs, Ryan Howard, and uh, da, 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 who is that? Oh, Justin Morneau. Ryan Howard is one of four players to win Rookie of the Year and then MVP in consecutive years, a World Series winner. CJ Crone. And we got something to flip backwards here. That is a Harrison Bader. Uh, okay, Purple Parallel. I guess that's why it was flipped backwards. UC Kikuchi, Devin Williams, Cal Raleigh, Tanner Bibby, Pete Crow Armstrong debuted uh, in the majors at the end of last season. Bobby Witt Jr., who had two home runs today, five RBI, and how about those Royals with a 9-4 and four record? Uh, they were one of the worst teams last year, but uh, so far they are very competitive. In that AL Central, Joe Morgan and Ronald Acuna, then and now. And Ryan Mountcastle. Uh, Esturi Ruiz, Bryson Stott, my Phillies won today, and uh, he contributed with a home run. Brady Singer, as you can see, got a uh, blue sparkle coming up. The Beebs, Quinn Priester. 2013 MVPs, Miggy and Andrew McCutcheon. Miggy is now retired, and McCutcheon signed a one-year deal to stay in Pittsburgh. JT Realmuto, Nico Horner, now a Gold Glove winner. Anthony Volpe, wow, that is a, a very nice hit. Not quite Ellie De La Cruz, but hey, Anthony Volpe, that'll do very nicely. Mike Schmidt and George Brett. Hall of Famers, World Series winners, and uh, MVP winners. There is uh, four MVPs between the two of them. Gavin Lux, Josh Lowe, Jack Sawinski, Eddie Rosario, Tyler Wells, Julio Pablo Martinez, Manny Machado, New Age Performers. And uh, World Series 2023. Not sure who that is. Either Evan Carter, Josh Young, but uh, in any case, the Rangers, they won their first World Series in franchise history last year. Owen White, Patrick Wisdom. Go on over to my short section if you get the chance. I met him at a free autograph signing last year, and there is footage of that signing. Max Kepler, Drew Rasmussen, Nolan Jones, Alan Winans, Clayton Kershaw, who briefly was a free agent, uh, signed an extension to stay in L.A., MVP winner, Cy Young winner, World Series winner. He's going to be a future first ballot Hall of Famer when his time comes. MVP winner, Paul Goldschmidt, Yuri Perez, Emerson Hancock, Alec Bohm. I think he hit a home run today. This guy, you know, I, I, I can never remember the pronunciation of his name. Uh, Red Sheendienst, I, I believe that's the correct pronunci pronunciation, and uh, he's a Hall of Famer. 
Dominic Fletcher. Uh, this is a white parallel of Luke Weaver. There's a good chance that I may miss. There's so many parallels, variations. I'll probably miss one. Uh, so forgive me in advance. Jesus, Lazardo, Reed Detmers, Jeff McNeil. The Mets and their bats came alive today, scoring 16 runs uh, against the Braves. See ya, Suzuki. We got something flipped backwards here. That is a Giancarlo Stanton. I guess it's an image variant. That's why it's flipped backwards. Has a couple of home runs on the year as he moves closer to 500 career home runs. Oh, another blue sparkle. That is Owen White. Rookie card. Very nice. Everson Pereira. Brett Beatty. Tariq Skubal. What do we got here? Batting leaders. Uh, Luis Arise and Yandy Diaz. Yandy Diaz finished with uh, a 330 average last year. And Luis Arise, I believe, he finished with a 354 batting average. Uh, Diaz has gotten off to a nice start, but not so much with a rise. Clayton Kershaw, New Age Performers, and Akeem Ryan Hayes, who is now a Gold Glove winner. Pirates have dropped two in a row. Clark Schmidt, Bryce Miller, Mookie Betts, Nestor Cortez, Hall of Famer, MVP winner, Cy Young winner, World Series winner, Jim Palmer, and William Contreras. Now, any numbered card, from what I have seen, it's going to be numbered in the upper left corner, on the front. Jose Barrios, and if there's any autos, uh, I believe it's going to be in something other than black ink. Salvador Perez. Now, this is a uh, variation or an SP because it has no auto on the front. Kyle Bradish. Mackenzie Gore. Hunter Goodman. And a Shane McClanahan. Blue Speckle. Blue Sparkle, I'm sorry. Sparkle, Speckle. Heston Kirstad. Another a bright young star that is part of the Orioles and that monster of a lineup they have. Mark Kana uh, was with Oakland. Who is, I guess he's with the Tigers now. Yeah. Justin Steele, who was uh, finished in the top three in last year's Cy Young voting. Christopher Morell. Earl Weaver, Raphael Devers, Matt McLean. What do we got here? Uh, another, that's Adolis Garcia. Celebrating probably a home run during the World Series. Corbin Carroll, very nice. And I uh, got uh, Shintaro Fujinama. Hagen Danner. Sparky Anderson, Hall of Famer. Manager of the Tigers and the Reds. Former manager. Bobby Miller. Two-time MVP, 3,000 hits in his career. Hall of Famer Robin Yount spent his whole career in uh, Milwaukee. Kyle Stowers. We're down to the final two packs. Uh, victory leaders. Corbin Burns, Cy Young winner, now with the Orioles. Ha Song Kim. Ellie De La Cruz. There we go. Michael Conforto. Uh, Christian Walker. Garrett Cole, last year's uh, Cy Young winner in the AL. 
Curtis Mead hails from Australia. Kevin Newman. And we finish off with Edgar Navarro. So let's do a quick recap. Uh, the Ellie De La Cruz rookie card, very sharp. Uh, the blue sparkle of Anthony Volpe, Owen White, Shane McClanahan, and this missing signature SP of all-star catcher Salvador Perez. That concludes this rip of 2024 Topps Heritage Baseball. This is going to be, that's, that was my first look at it. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to hit like and subscribe and uh, have yourselves a wonderful night. I initially misspoke when I said this card was a no signature parallel SP, whatever. It is signed or it's a facsimile signature. It's just very saint. But uh, yeah, there it is. So I was wrong about that. Just wanted to clarify that. Thanks again for watching.